Today I'm going to show you how to do this fun and funky butterfly. Today's craft, you're going to need at least one sheet of paper and some paints. We have finger paints here. Tempera paints would work as well. I like to use the paper plates to put the paints on because then we can just throw it away when we're done. And then on, on our paper, we're going to be designing half of a butterfly. So I'm going to do a quick drawing of half a butterfly to help my kids keep inside the lines. So I'm going to start in the middle of the paper and I'm just drawing like big heart shape for the wing. And that's it. Now Lily's gonna add her paint inside of both of these parts and then we're gonna fold it in half to make our butterfly. My favorite thing that I did in my life is Snoop. Wait, my name is Jumpin'. What's your name? Goodbye. Right, you're getting started. Mm -hmm. The idea is to keep the paint. I drew a little line in the middle to guide my kids to keep the paint inside this half a wing because we're going to be folding it in half. We're using fun finger paints, but you're oh, welcome to use a brush. I get it off. We can use a baby wipe. Sure, bud. We're low on paper towels in our house, but we have plenty of baby wipes, so we are using baby wipes to wipe between colors. Oh We're gonna want lots and lots of paint here. So guys, don't be shy. Layer on the paint. Lots and lots of paint. Mommy, yeah, bud. opportunity to experiment with mixing colors and textures. Okay, so my kids have some really cool designs now for their butterfly and we want to fold our paper in half right on that line and press it down good. So I'm gonna fold it over. I'm just showing them what to do and then you can do it. And then you press it really hard. Okay, so Jonathan, you want to give it a try? Go ahead. Wait, all the way, and then push it really hard. Don't, don't want to smear it, you just want to press it. And then we're gonna open it back up. Open it back up, and there's our beautiful butterfly. And then after ours dry, we're going to cut them out and glue them onto a popsicle stick. Mine can come out just like dropping. You can add more paint. We can open it up and add more paint. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. For the final step of our butterfly project, you can cut out your butterfly and you can even glue it to a popsicle stick so that you can make it look like it's Here's our fun and funky butterfly. We glued a popsicle stick on the back. You don't have to do that. And we did cut ours out. You also don't have to do that, but it kind of makes it a little bit more fun. Hope you make one. If you do, send me a picture or video.